using this AI depth monitoring, now I know if a subject is too close to my VR warranty camera. This is amazing! Today, we will take a look at the Lumpad 2, an AI-powered 3D tablet that allows VR content creators to see 3D without wearing a VR glasses or a 3D glasses. If you like 3D content and want an easy way to show it to your friends or clients, this is the video for you. This video will also teach you how to use Luma AI and Lumpack 2 together to create 3D model with Nerf and AI for free. If you are an old school 3D gamers, this video will teach you how to play Virtual Boy games and Nintendo 3DS games like The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D in full time of the original resolution. I already did an in-depth review of Generation 1 of the Lumpack right here. Lumpack 2 take it to a whole new level with AI assist active face tracking, AI 3D image generation powered by stable diffusion, and two beautiful 3D live view cameras. Here are the detailed specs of the Lumpack 2. But is it worth over 1,000 US dollars? Can this expensive gadget really help you as a 3D or VR content creator? Or will it end up on your shelf again to collect dust after the initial hype and excitement? Well, let's step back to talk about the resurrection of 3D industry, thanks to VR and AI. On the capture side, Canon launched the RF Duo Fisheye lens last year and we seen a rise of high quality stereoscopic 3D 180 content inside VR headset on platforms like MetaQuest TV and YouTube VR. Even the famous horror movie director Eli Roth made a 3D 180 film called Be Mine this year. To see all these 3D videos and film in 3D, you will need a VR headset, which is very inconvenient for most people, and the content is not shareable. The advance in AI, specifically and technology called NERFs, Neural Radiance Fields, allow anyone to capture 3D model and 3D environments with lighting and texture baked in using a cell phone and a free app like Luma AI. Anyone can be a 3D artist nowadays and turn any object into 3D. But the same problem remains, there is no effective way to see 3D, interact with 3D or share in 3D. To support the explosion of 3D and VR creator industry, we need a portable display to showcase our works. And Leah in Lumpack 2 right here solved this problem, or at least attempting to solve the problem with AI. Thank you Leah for sending me the Lumpack 2 and sponsoring this video so I can test it for our viewers. Just like all my other review videos, I will try to be fair and point out the good and the bad so you can make an educated decision on this new gadget. Let's start with the overhyped feature that I personally think and it's not ready and should not be the reason why you buy the Lumpack 2. That is the 2D to 3D conversion using AI. Using the app LiaTube, Lumpack 2 can convert any 2D video into 3D by simply using a URL of the original video. The AI is generating depth map in real time. The quality of the 3D depends on the resolution and bit depth of the depth map. Even though this is a very impressive technology, 3D is very unforgiven when it is wrong. You feel sick immediately when something seems to be off. The Lumpad 2 AI gets the depth wrong here and there, and it's not high resolution enough to follow straight edges. 
It can, however, convert even monoscopic 360 video into 3D 360 video with full 360 interactivity. As you see right here, I convert my mono 360 music video into 3D. You can look around in 3D. It's very impressive as a gimmick to wow people, but unfortunately not good enough for long time content consumption. Even I get a little bit sick after watching 5 minutes of AI generated 3D video. To be fair, this 2D to 3D conversion is happening on the fly with a Qualcomm Snapdragon mobile chip. So higher resolution video on YouTube like 4K and 8K will not have a good enough result. Lia is launching 2D to 3D cloud service, which will use the latest NVIDIA RTX graphic cards and cloud computing to do slow but high quality 2D to 3D conversion. This will have way better results in full 8K top and bottom or side by side. We will cover that in another tech deep dive video coming very soon. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell. Loompad 2 really shine when you watch professionally shot 3D content. Lia Flex allow you to rent any 3D movies and watch them on a gorgeous 12.4 inch 3D screen without a 3D glasses. But I think it is more impressive when you can look all around in 180 or 360 degrees in full 3D. But the question is, where can you find free 3D 180 and 3D 360 content? Well, luckily, I have you covered. Head over to my YouTube channel. We have 3D playlists for travel, music, dance, and original narrative content. Find this 3D label in my video thumbnail right here to indicate 3D. Simply hit share and you can send the video directly to LeahTube. Now you can watch 3D video and also pan to look around. We constantly push out high quality VR 180 and 3D 360 videos on YouTube. So don't forget to subscribe and hit the notification bell, especially if you are planning to get the Loompad 2 right here. Loompad 2 become a very, very attractive purchase when you are a VR or 3D content creator. Now, let's talk about using the Loompad 2 right here to create content. A great use case for me as a VR filmmaker is using it to help with blogging. Blogging in film refers to the placement and the movement of actor in relationship to the camera. 3D camera introduce one more element, depth. Basically, how close can the talents get to the camera before making viewers cross eye. You're showing his balls in his wiener. Nani? By aligning my Canon EOS R5C with the dual fisheye lens with the Lumpak 2 front camera, I get a light depth map to tell me the depth of the scene with the help of AI. If the talent gets too close, AI would tell me too close with a red border with a warning message to say too much depth. It is also great to show the clients, set designers, or director who are not used to shooting with a 3D camera at the Canon R5C right here. You can even do a quick recording on the Loompad and play back the video to illustrate your point further in true 3D without a VR headset. To see the camera feed, I installed the Holy View app and sent my video feed with Holy Land Mars 4K directly into the Loompad 2. So you can also use as a big on set monitor. I wish Laya can talk to the Holy View app and convert the camera signal into 3D in real time. That will be dream come true. Unfortunately though, Loompad is not there yet. Now let's learn how you can use Luma AI to capture any object and bring it into Loompack 2 in true 3D. Find an object without a reflective surface to capture. I used my Lion Trophy here, which I recently won at Barcelona International Film Festival. Follow the Luma AI capture instruction to go around the trophy three times and three different heights. Upload the capture onto Luma AI. 
after the process is done, you can download your Luma AI Capture as GLTF right here. OBJ and USDZ also work, but you will need to texture it. So GLTF is the easiest with all the beautiful lighting and texture baked in already. Now send the GLTF file into your Loom Pack 2 using Google Drive. Download the GLB files onto your Loom Pack 2. Open Lia Viewer and tap the plus icon right here to load in the GLB file. Look at that! The Lion Trophy is now in full 3D, popping out of your tablet and you can also interact with it. You can adjust the depth on the left side, turn it into 2D here, and even adjust the lighting and material just like in Blender. Very powerful. Also, a great way to show your 3D art to your friends by passing the Loom Pack to them. Loom Pack 2 will also release integration with Luma AI text to 3D application called Imagine 3D. You can directly load in 3D models generated completely with text prompt and AI, like this Goku model here from Dragon Ball Z from Imagine 3D Alpha release. This is very exciting and I can't wait to cover more Luma AI and Nerf tutorial for you using Loom Pack 2. You can even use Stable Diffusion from Stability AI, built right inside the Loom Pack 2 to generate 3D art from a simple text plum. Anyone can be a 3D artist with Loom Pack 2. No 3D or VFX knowledge is required. Let me show you now. The app you need is Lear Dream. Make sure to update to the latest version as Stable Diffusion update very often. Lear Dream is not 100% free. It gives you 500 credits free to start and it costs $10 for 1000 credits. Kind of like OpenAI model. Here tell you how much credit you will need to generate this AI art. It is not a stable diffusion tutorial, so I would highly recommend checking out my other tutorial right here on stable diffusion to understand GF CFG, step, and all the other AI art settings. You can use control net that map and image to image in Lear Dream. Tap your icon right here and up in beta program. Now you see beta program feature. It allows you to upload an image as a reference. Here I select Kitty, which captured with the Lia camera as a depth reference. Select Stable Diffusion V1.5 model and type in a positive and a negative prompt. Woman warrior sitting in front of an Asian art. Negative palm will be bad composition, low resolution. Click dream. Pretty good. The quality is on par with Mid Journey V5. Again, you can do more work to make it better by using better prom and the beta in painting feature. Tap the image. Wow. Now your generated art is in 3D. You can adjust your front ground and your background tab using this slider. Tap here to auto animate the picture and tap here to share on Lia Pix. Lia's own social media network for 3D artists. For VR filmmakers, I have the best for last. Since Loom Pack 2 has way higher spec Snapdragon chips than even the MetaQuest Pro, we can easily play back 8K, 3D, 180, and 3D 360 immersive videos locally with stunning image quality. With the latest 90 built Lia player, we can also view VR 180 photos captured by your Canon R5 with dual fisheye lens. This is really the best way to view 3D 180 and 3D 360 content. All you need to do is to connect your Loom Pack 2 to your computer using a USB-C cable. Mac user, you need to download the Android file transfer app first and simply move your VR video onto the movie folders and your 180 or 360 3D photos into the picture folders. I would suggest rename your media to this naming convention to tell Lear player what kind of VR videos or photo each file is. You can also tag your media inside Lear player like so. Then simply play the video and photo. Hold your Loom Pack 2 to move around to look around. It is like seeing through a window to another 3D world. Pretty trippy. Comment below if you're having issue loading your 3D media locally onto your Loom Pack 2 so I can help you.
This review video focuses on practical creative feature Lia Pack 2 has to offer. If you are a gamer, you can play game in 3D. Remember Nintendo Virtual Boy from 1995? Now you can play all the old school Virtual Boy VR game with Loom Pack 2 for free using a 3D emulator called Virtual Virtual Boy. Simply head over to Lia App Store, search and download VVB. Low game. Here is elevated speed from 1987 in full 3D. It is freaking amazing. Here is VUE Snake in 2009, which has the best 3D and hella fun, especially in the multiplayer mode, which you can complete with your friends on the same Loom Pack 2. Okay, if you are not an 80 babies, old man like me, how about some Nintendo 3DS game? My favorite is The Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time 3D. Here is how you can play The Legend of Zelda in full time of the original Nintendo 2DS resolution on Loom Pack 2. Trust me, this is the best Zelda 3D experience you will ever have. On your Loom Pack 2, go to the GitHub link down below and down the Citra Loom Pack 2 build. Install the APK as it is not on the official Lear store just yet. It is a hack but it is the best hack on this device. You will need the Legend of Zelda Ocarina of Time game ROM. You can find it easily on the internet. Move the game onto your Loom Pack 2, open Citra and point the game folder to where you download Zelda. Go ahead and launch the game. Open the setting menu by pressing the back button, set the internal resolution to 4x and use side-by-side -side stereoscopic 3D mode. Now enjoy the game in beautiful 3D. If you like more game tips and hack on the Loom Pack 2, please comment below for a more in-depth tutorial on 3DS game emulation and where to find 3DS game to play. For productivity, you can do Zoom call in 3D using Lia Chat, but whoever you are calling has to also has a Loom Pack 2. With the gorgeous display, powerful Snapdragon AAA 5G processor, and impressive AI face tracking, I have a feature list that I wish Lia could implement into the Loom Pack 2 in the upcoming updates, so it is more useful for XR creator and I need your comment and upvote to validate the needs. First, enable Loompad as a secondary 3D display for my Mac or PC. It should have direct integration into Adobe Premiere and DaVinci Resolve, so 3D video editors can see 3D and depth. Right now, we have no display solution out there for 3D editing. It would be great if software like Blender Premiere, Fusion, Unreal Engine, or Unity could talk to Loompad and show the editing preview window in true 3D. Second, it should automatically turn any side-by-side -side and top and bottom video into 3D. YouTube VR on Android, Install 360 Pro 2 monitoring app, and Holy View app mentioned above can all push out a side-by-side -side view. If Loompad can be smart enough to convert that side-by-side -side view into true 2D view. This will make the display very useful on any 3D film set. Third, remember the list of videos I convert in the Lia 2, so I don't need to do it again. Four, the ability to play local side-by-side -side video content via a USB flash drive or even an SD card reader, so you can watch your own 3D video locally without paying for streaming services or wasting time on download and 3D conversion, especially for places without internet access like on a plane. I discussed all these possible features with Lia team and they are working their ass off to make all this happen. And they are also actively monitor this video comment session right here. So if you have a feature you think it is missing on the current version of the Loom Pack 2, comment below. At the end of the day, if Loom Pack 2 can lend me more 3D and VR filming jobs, it is definitely worth $1,000. US 
it is so much easier to show people my 3D film on Lumpack in person than in a VR headset other than a Quest in a trade show or a film festival. What do you think? We will continue to make tutorial on how to use the Lumpack 2 for immersive creator. Also, we will dive deeper on AI 2D to 2D conversion without the Lumpack 2. If AI can generate 3D for us, we wouldn't need expensive 3D 360 camera like the Insta Pro 2 or Titan anymore. It will make capturing for VR so much easier. These are all coming next. So don't forget to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and give this video a big thumb up. Join our XR Filmmaker community and together push immersive storytelling to the next level. I will see you next time.